Hello, I'm John Bogue from Witch Computing and we're producing a series of video clips to help you get the most from your computing experience. In this video, I'm going to explain how to detect spyware and clear the main elements of your cache. Even if you're running a good firewall or antivirus program, you might still download spyware by accident. If you notice your computer starts running slowly or if the internet becomes very sluggish, you may have spyware on your computer. Other indications of spyware include odd-looking icons on your desktop, receiving a lot of pop-ups, or possibly new toolbars appearing in your web browser. If you don't take action right away, things will only get worse, and your computer will get slower. If spyware gets a hold on your computer, it will often disable your antivirus and anti-spyware programs. You may not realize it at first, so always try to update and run your security programs as a check. There are many good free anti-spyware programs, including Windows Defender and Spybot Search and Destroy. Anti-spyware works by looking at the files on your computer and comparing them to lists of known spyware. To prevent attracting spyware, every month you should clear out your web browser cache. This will include cookies and temporary internet files. Cookies are little bits of information exchanged between your web browser and a website. They can be used by your spyware to track your personal details online. To clear out your web cache, start your web browser. Go to Tools, Internet Options. In Browsing History, click the Delete button. Then in Temporary Internet Files, click Delete Files. In the Confirmation box, click Yes. Then in Cookies, click Delete Cookies. And in the Confirmation box, click Yes again. Then in the Internet Options window, click OK for the changes to take effect. File sharing websites can be a rich source of spyware. Beware of sites giving away free software and screensavers. Never download software from sites that you don't trust or know. If a site looks suspicious or is trying to force you to download strange files, don't do it. If you don't know who sent you an email, don't open the email or its attachment, just delete it you should now be able to detect and recognize spyware. We hope this will get you out of trouble next time your computer starts acting up. Thank you for watching.